So kann man jetzt gleich. I just, I just believe my Bible, mate. It just says there's nothing else. The other things I think, uh, sorry, I, I must admit, I haven't traced through all the references to the other things, the errands, rod that budded and all that. I think they were beside the ark, not in it, and it doesn't seem as though they were around at this stage. Well, at least they're not mentioned. So my, my hunch is that they were by the ark, not in the ark. There are a number of prepositions that are a little ambiguous as to exactly where they were. Uh, that's my hunch, and I haven't done the work that I should have done going through every single text that refers to them and find out whether that works. But uh, that's, my, that, that's my guess about those things. There's just the one thing in the ark, inside. Yeah, but it's only a Christian custom. Right? It's a Christian. And there's nothing wrong. You, you need customs. We've got Christian customs. You just don't put too much store by them. They're not, they're not theologically important. They're part of our customs. So we've got, uh, we've got lots of Christian customs, and they're okay. And uh, our buildings um, uh, uh, say something later about this, Rick, and correct me. Uh, when buildings are consecrated, that, that, that's a custom to keep control in an appropriate way of buildings that are head, held on trust, that they're not misused, uh, I think. Uh, you you realise that uh, when a building is consecrated or licensed, it's actually restricted. You now, there's a, now a whole lot of things you can't do in that building rather than it, it's sort of the opposite of the word licensing. Uh, but and I think it goes back to just a, an orderly use of our properties to see that properties that have been acquired or built by Christian people uh, are not uh, abused or misused. Uh, but there's nothing biblical about that, nothing at all biblical about that. Indeed, even, even Solomon's temple, there is a little word, I forgot, it'll come up I think somewhere a little bit later on, where the word dedicated. The temple, and I don't... I, my work on that word is it means put into use for the first time. So even that word does, but the word consecrated is used in this parts of the courtyard are set apart for particular uses, but none of that comes over into Christian practice according to the New Testament. Uh, we've developed some customs, but we've just got to keep very careful that we don't fill them with theological, spiritual significance that they really ought to have because that is the, that's the path to slip back into Old Testament religion, which we mustn't do. Thank you. Anything else? I reckon we're done.